start tonight with new video showing the intense fire that destroyed a boat in Spring Lake with a man on board. Fears confirmed tonight as officials find a body on board the vessel, a man believed to be a Grand Rapids firefighter. 24-hour news aide Sarah Hurwitz is just back from the Lakeshore with the latest on this story tonight. Sarah. Good evening, Leon. Well, we don't know if Dave Nicely, the owner of the boat and a full-time firefighter with Grand Rapids Fire Department, but we do know that Nicely is still missing and was last seen Saturday night around the Barrett Boat Works Marina. All right, well just after five this morning, an orange glow as flames devoured a boat sitting at the dock at the Barrett Works Marina in Spring Lake Township. The boat was fully involved. Um, at that point, we had to stretch uh, approximately 400 feet of, of hose lines down the dock to try to combat this fire. This is new video from the Grand Haven Tribune that shows the intensity of the fire as crews work to put out the flames. And there were reports of someone possibly on board, but the fire was too dangerous to save anyone. The boat's owner is Dave Nicely, a firefighter for the city of Grand Rapids. He is unaccounted for, last seen Saturday night near the marina. And there's always a fear for firefighters. Do I know anyone involved in the call? Is it someone who's been there on the line with me? So there's no question that, you know, when you hear that, that brings a, uh, a different component. Holding back tears, Spring Lake Township Fire Chief Brian Seip touches on the brotherhood within the fire department. When people tell you that uh, one of your own, so to speak, could be um, missing or anything like that, it, it, it hits home, obviously. Um, so uh, it's, uh, you hear that type of thing and um, it's, it's hard, it's hard wrenching. And the agonizing wait spanned several hours. Family, friends, watching, hugging and hoping. Grand Rapids firefighters among them. And then the confirmation of a body. The Ottawa County Sheriff's Office says a person who they have yet to identify was found inside the boat. As the medical examiner arrived, a line of Grand Rapids firefighters stood by the charred remains of what was left of that boat. And the cause of the fire is under investigation. The fire did cause minor damage to a boat next to it. Now, fire crews say that these types of fires burn hot and they can spread quickly because of the fuel. In studio control, Sarah Hurwitz, 24-hour news 8. Okay, Leon. Sarah, thank you for that.